Incoming rockets targeting civilian population have become a major challenge for Israel, and there's a constant search for solutions against it. On Tuesday, Prime Minister Naftali Bennett visited the Haifa headquarters of the Rafael Advanced Defense Systems to get a close look at the development of the company's laser system called Magen Or, meaning light shield in English. It is meant to send a high-power laser beam towards an incoming threat, hitting it until it explodes in mid-air. Rafael's laser system is a strategic tiebreaker, not only in Israel, but in the entire world. It's a system that already knows how to bring down a mortar, a UAV, a rocket. For more than a decade, Israel has had the Iron Dome system, which has proved very effective in dealing with those threats, but is also very expensive. Each intercepting missile is said to cost some 50,000 US dollars, which means that bringing down tens of thousands of rockets would have a huge economic toll. A laser would be a major revolution. It's a tiebreaker, not only because we hit our enemies militarily, but also economically. Until now, intercepting every rocket cost us a lot of money. Now, they would invest tens of thousands of dollars in rockets, and we would invest two dollars for the electricity needed to bring that rocket down. The hope is to have the system ready sometime next year and incorporate it into the multi-layer defense system Yet another aspect in the unending cat-and-mouse race between Israel and its enemies.